So I know I've really been slacking on videos, um, but in this video, I stripped out the hole inside. Um, I then put down um, EVA foam. I just used closed cell craft foam uh, for sound dampening. Um, I spray adhesive that all along the floor in the areas where there was gonna be the most sound. Um, I also put down strips of like the tar with the um, like the peel and seal, the tar with the aluminum backing. I put that in the really like solid flat metal areas to kind of maybe help drown out some of it, um, the tinny noise along with the Eva foam. And then on top of that, I got a double layer foil kind of like almost like a bubble wrap, but not so much for insulation. Um, I put that all along the floorboard, along the back wall. I'm going to be doing the roof in that. And then on top of that, I put down new vinyl. Um, I really didn't record a whole lot after I put that in. Um, I did start to put back in the dash, but I was just having problems getting certain things to line up. Um, but I ended up getting it in, and in the next video, I'll go over everything because I'll be continuing to really bolt it down so it's secure now but um here's the video and i hope you enjoy it and at the end of the video if you guys want to help support the build i'm not asking for money and i'm not asking you to do anything too extreme but just watch at the end of the video and if you feel like helping you feel like helping if not no problem just like share and subscribe All right, as you can see, I started taking everything out. Um, really, today is what we're going to do. We're going to strip all this out, take this out, take this out, take it all out, clean up real good. I am going to redneck makeshift um, sound dampening. Um, I got the tar mat, but I found some that has low smell. And then I'm going to use Eva foam, closed cell craft foam, and spray adhesive it down to the bottom, plus then the stock mat. And we're going to be installing the new vinyl flooring I got from Rock Auto.
All right, guys. So it's the next day now. Um, I ran into some problems getting out the AC, as you could see, but I got it all pulled out. Now, like I said, I'm doing somewhat of a redneck um, sound dampening and heat insulation. It's far from perfect, but it is what it is. Um, I first went through and stuck this on a lot of places up and under there, under there, on the solid part, solid part. And then I went through and I got closed cell EVA foam. And I just got it in small sections. So it's not perfect, but. Beats. I mean, even the old stuff, so. And then on top of it, to keep temperature wise, I'm going to be running this double-sided heat this double-sided heat underneath my mat my vinyl flooring I'm gonna be putting this on the doors oh I did put it on the back there so I don't know if you can hear but sure beats that So, I'm gonna be putting it up on there. Um, when I eventually go to, I'm gonna put it on the front doors. When I go to redo the back doors, I'm gonna put it on that. And then I will be putting it on the roof also, um, just to try and keep the temperature down. Um, but yeah, that's it so far. Um, let me uh, let me get moving on this. And when I get all the floor done and the back done, I'll show you. All right, guys, so this is with the insulation down on the floor. Double layered in the center. Got it along the back wall, too. Um, now I'm going to be putting down the mat and then be installing the vinyl. Hopefully by today, I'll have everything in, all my areas cut. I got to cut these a little nicer so they're not as beat up looking. Um, but yeah, everything should be in now by uh, the end of the day. At least all the flooring will. I got to wait because I got to put that AC back in. Um, those parts won't be here till tomorrow. I will be lining the doors with this also. Um, just to help. And then when I get to the ceiling, I'll be doing the ceiling in that also. All right, guys. Well, see you in a little bit.
All right, guys, so that was the video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I know I was kind of slacking. I was just kind of in a zone. I would pop up and film every once in a while, but I didn't really go too crazy into detail. Um, and yeah, that's really it. I got everything stripped out like you've seen and uh, put down all that stuff. Now, when I bang on the vinyl, it's completely muffled. You hear no metal noise. Even my 2018 uh, Dodger and 1500 that my wife drives, you can still kind of hear noise if you bang where there isn't the actual fiber padding. Because um, I did put that on top of everything also. But what I wanted to share with you was if you want to support the build and then hey, possibly make some money also, there's an app out there called Get Upside. Now it's a simple app, it's free to use. You create an account, I'll have a link in the description below, and you buy gas from select gas stations, and there's normally quite a bit around, and I've been all over South Florida, and I haven't ever had a problem to use one, and there's always one within a mile normally. Um, for any gas you buy with a credit card or a debit card, um, you just get a receipt of it, take a photo, and you get anywhere from, some of them go all the way down to six cents, but if you keep sharing and getting more and more people on, you can do what I let, I've been doing and you've been getting around 25 to 30 cents a gallon back. It adds up, make about 20 bucks a week. And uh, yeah, I mean, if you use my referral code down below for every gallon you buy, I'll get one cent. And then anyone you refer, every gallon they buy, I'll get 0.5 cent. Um, doesn't sound like a lot, but it adds up over time, which is money that I can turn around and use for the build. So I appreciate if you would do it. And like I said, if you like the video, like, subscribe, and share.